says, anyone know how to troubleshoot this problem? Microsoft 365 Word Online will not print. The all done window appears, but we never see the window that allows us to send the file to a printer. Word that is installed locally prints perfectly. The problem is just with Word Online. I would love some suggestions. I haven't been able to find anything on the Microsoft website. Have you got a policy in place that prevents <laughs> for a particular license to print to local printers is a big one I found recently. I didn't have this problem with Word. I had this with the other content pulled up in the browser where it was had this issue where when I downloaded it and then printed it, it would print. But if I tried to print directly from the browser, it would never yep. print. So, and so that wasn't a Microsoft Word issue. So that's so a lot of people don't think about the fact that browsers are applications. They think, you know, the browser is just kind of nebulous and it's there and I just use it. But people forget that the browser in and of itself is an application on your machine and has its own settings. So oftentimes when I see issues like this, especially since they say that it works fine in the word client, it tells me that you probably need to go into your browser settings and you need to check your print settings for your browser itself. And just remember, many people use multiple browsers. They might have multiple versions. Maybe um, if you're using Chrome, it probably needs to be updated because it always needs to be updated, you know, things like that. So I would double check your browser settings and look at the print settings for your browser and make sure that those are filled into the local printer that you want to use. Otherwise, what ends up happening is anything you print inside of that browser is going to go into some black hole somewhere. And then what's going to happen is when you do set it up, there's going to be a day that all of a sudden your printer is going to connect and it's going to get 87 print jobs and all your kids things that they printed off those browsers are all going to come flying out of your printer. Yeah, and where's the print queue for that one? Um, yeah. And to troubleshoot that, they could try a different browser. Let's, you know, say let's go mm -hmm. into um, Chrome or Edge or Safari or pick another browser and see if it's happening across all of the browsers. That might be one way to troubleshoot. And then I'm with you on the about application settings. So partial answer to the question sh that Sherry you just asked, like you know, where is that printing queue? So that's the problem is that they don't actually get to a queue until the connection is there, then they'll yeah. show up. So when they start suddenly, you, you turn on the printer and and you've forgotten about them and the 87 that are lined up, you can then go into the print queue after you look at the first 10 that have been gone to print <laughs> and uh, realize it's all garbage. What it, what's going on? Go look at your printer queue. You'll see them all. So yeah. there's, yeah, there's something that's happening where it's not even sending it over to the queue. That's part of the problem. So it's interrupting it before it gets to the queue. And then, but that message is still out there in transit. And once you fix it, it'll then all, they'll all show they'll up. They'll all catch so, up. Yep. Yeah. Super frustrating. Yeah. We and have, it happens a lot. I see a lot yeah. of people struggle with this. And if you think about like, if you go to a public machine, so you think about libraries and things like that, I can only imagine what's in their print queues from people printing things in the browser, but it's not set up to go to the printer properly. Yeah. Yeah. We have two printers in our house, and if I don't, if, I, if I'm low on the ink, I'll print to Steve's office or whatever. And it was held up for something, so I killed it, and then I went over there, and just what you said, there was like 50 pieces of paper laying on the floor because he had stuff that got locked up, and when I freed up mine that was locking it up, all of the stuff spit out on his printer. I was like, <laughs> okay, so many trees. So many trees. Somebody complained um, about a printer problem the other day on Facebook, and I legitimately responded with the answer of, email it to the UPS store. <laughs> yes. Amen. <laughs> yep. The home printer is dead, guys. The yeah. home printer is dead. I, I had the problem where I, uh, so I, as we're getting ready to move, you know, I've been printing a few things and, uh, and others, but uh, where uh, I bought ink last year in tax season and then hadn't used my printer until this year tax season. Oops. So all of my brand new cartridges, they were like dried out. Yep. Yep. So yep. UPS yep. store. Yep. yep. Well, like all things, clear the cache, remove the printers, uh, re-add it. Did it still do it? When no. people email <laughs> me and say, hey, you can print this, I just delete that person from my... <laughs> <laughs> from my system. Always a good solution. 
<laughs> I don't want Control. that kind of negativity really. in my life. So right? yeah. just right. auto forward it to the UPS store. Duh. <laughs> <laughs>